When we're young, we're taught the difference between a hero and a villain, good and evil, a savior and a lost cause. But what if the truth is that the only difference is just who's telling the story? My name is Hope Michelson. I come from a long line of the villains in your stories. I'm the daughter of a werewolf and a vampire, the granddaughter of an evil witch. They call me the Tribrid. I'm the only one of my kind. I'm born from evil, fighting every day to be good. There's no place in the world for someone like me. Except one, the Salvatore School. We teach discipline, compassion, a little magic. But mostly, it's a place where we keep them safe. And I've just spent a lot of time with supernatural people who are never comfortable in who they were. These kids, these kids will be better. The locals think we're a school for troubled rich kids. The troubled part is true. We fall asleep in geometry and pass notes in magical history. We throw parties in the woods and crash the local high school's dances. We fall in and out of love and break each other's hearts. Like so many who came before us, we're not all good, we're not all bad, but we are all different, whether we like it or not. Any one of us could snap and become the villain of someone else's story. That's why there are rules. Rule number one, no one can know who we are or what we can do. Thanks, Landon. Rule number two, don't get close with the locals. When we open up to strangers, we risk exposing our secrets. You want me to dance with you? I'm kind of living in the moment here. When local boy Landon Kirby entered my life, I learned the consequences of breaking the rules. <laughs> in opening up to an innocent, I opened the door to something bigger than both of us, something bigger than the school, its secrets, or even the town of Mystic Falls, something that could bring us all to our knees. This is a story of magic, of secrets and betrayals, first loves and first heartbreaks. It's a story of friendship and family, of battling our own demons so we can face the monsters around us. This is a story, our story, about trying to be normal in a world that's anything but. The only question is, will we be its heroes or its villains?